are currently in Dizon Paris and we thought that we would do a little merch tour of all the shops on Main Street USA. Okay, our first stop, Main Street Motors. This is one of our favourite shops in Dizon Paris because it sells all the good clothes. Yeah, it sells it? Like, mostly like fashion clothes. Yeah. It's all for adults. And jewellery and stuff. Yeah. Okay, so the first thing, as you walk in the door, is the Disneyland Paris so Spirit jerseys. I'm so tempted to buy this one, even though I have the black Disneyland one, but it's my favourite. How much are they? They're £59.99. So pretty much exactly the same as in America. Yeah. Okay, so this is the new Spirit jersey that I haven't actually seen anywhere yet. I think it's the same price. What's it all like on the back, Becky? Um, I think it's red, white. Yeah, so it's like okay. the French flag. Oh, that's pretty cute. It is quite cute, isn't it? Yeah, I don't think I'd wear it because I don't have really wear white. But yeah, the white adorable. puts me off, but I've never seen this in any of the other Disney parks, like with Disneyland or Disney World on the back. And it's $59.99. Right, so I've noticed this trip, there's like a lot of Lion King stuff going on, a lot of Simba and Nala. That's really cute. They have this little bag that I haven't seen anywhere before, that's quite nice. And that is $29.99. Oh, what is it? Like pajamas. pajamas. And I love pajamas. Yeah. Becky is I obsessed with so. pajamas. That is cute. They're really cute. And this little Simba bag. It's only 12 99 The prices of the merch here isn't too bad, I wouldn't say, compared to Walt Disney World and Disneyland. On the French theme again, this cute jumper says Bonjour with Mickey on it. That's cute. I haven't seen that before. No, neither have I. It's only 40 euros. 40 euros. That's not bad for a sweatshirt. That's quite nice, actually. I like that. They have, like, quite a big collection of socks. We love socks. Becky is obsessed with socks. Now, they're not as cool as the ones in Tokyo, Disney. But there's still quite a lot. What? Oh, they're cute. Chippy how much are they? 9.99. 9.99. That's quite expensive for socks. Oh, well, I said not <laughs> Becky's bad. like, not bad. Becky loves not socks. Lucky. She's like, I'll have them all. Genie. And then, are these like Minnie Mouse socks? They're cute. I just don't think I could ever bring myself to spend this much on socks. Is Becky, this is this the, the trip that you're going to buy this skirt? <laughs> Becky no, looks at this no, skirt every it. single time. I tried she it. tried it on last time in Effin and it was so cute. It was really cute. What's on it? Is it mini? Yeah, so it's like little mini. Uh, mini and flowers. And flowers. But what? She just can't decide whether to buy it or not, even though it would be oh, perfect no. for our Disney cruise. How it's much is it? It's 64.99. I honestly think that's worth it. This is part of um, this Minnie Mouse range that they yeah, always it's like, have. It's like Disneyland Paris collection. Yeah. They have the cute jackets and shirts and stuff. But Becky looks at this adorable skirt every single trip. Are you going to buy it? Uh, probably not. I want it though. And to be honest, I look at these boots every time. They're the same. They have the Minnie Mouse on them. And they're not that expensive. I think they're like 30 or 35 euros from what I remember. Mm, 29.99. Yeah. I just, you do get AP discounts, so I am always tempted to buy those because they're really cute. They have really cute jewellery at Disneyland Paris, so I always get asked where I bought some of my jewellery from. And a lot of it is from here. I wonder if they have the famous castle necklace. This is like nicer stuff that they keep in little boxes. They've got the castle ring. they got the castle ring that everyone always asks us about. Yeah. Which I think is either eighteen ninety nine or twenty one ninety nine. It's eighteen ninety nine. Eighteen ninety nine. It's green. And then here is the necklace, which everyone always asks about. And how much is that, that one? Green as well. Green as well. So eighteen ninety nine. For a ring. I mean, the most expensive thing is thirty six ninety nine. I've never really seen anything that expensive. This is when Becky pulls something off that expensive. What's that? Blue. Twenty six ninety nine. That's that cute. cute. Okay, so they have this new range in Disneyland Paris, and it's like an America range. Why would you want an American flag with something that says Disneyland Paris? Surely you would want a French flag. I mean, these ears are quite cute. Hi, there's me. But why would you want to buy something that says Disneyland Paris with the American flag? I am baffled. <laughs> Okay, this is the first time I've ever seen Lance toy bags because I'm Paris and they actually have quite a few. 
I bet they're about 70 euros, but that is just, maybe this is the beginning of lounge fight at Disneyland Paris. Okay, and here is the new Disneyland Paris spirit jersey, the brand new one that just came out last week. It's Ariel's Grotto Coral, I think. It is quite it's nice. It's really nice, actually. I like that it's kind of pinky. Yeah, it's like pinky, but also orangey. Yeah. These are the ears. They're kind of more like the purple potion ears, like bow-wise, than the red ones. But you're quite tempted to buy these, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, they're, they're pretty cute. $22.99, I think Becky said earlier? Yes, $22.99. Are you going to get them? Maybe, maybe. And then they've got the new Aerial Grotto Coral Lounge Fly Bag. It's very sparkly, I like that quite it a lot. Is, Does it have a price on it? Uh, there's a tag here. No, that's, oh, that's no, not no, the price. Not it's not $22.99. Oh, $79.99. Oh, that's quite pricey for a lounge fly. It's so cute. But it is pretty. And you can't actually get this in any of the other parks at the minute, I don't believe. No Disneyland or Disney World coral. Aerial Grotto Coral. Okay, she's found another two Maybe. two. It's Are you gonna buy this one? It's it looks very long. It does look very long. You're not that tall. I'm not that tall. But it has no. Elsa on it. It's well cute. It's pretty cute. I think I'll stick with the mini one because I think. Then they have this, and they have a little bit of the Arendelle Aqua collection left. Just the backpack and the ears, though. I haven't seen the spirit jersey here at, at all on the last few trips, but it's still really cute. And then even more lounge fly. This stitch bag is adorable. Yeah. Are they all the same price? Are they all £79.99? Yes, yeah. they are. This one's so they got cool. the Maleficent one, they got the Groot one. What's this one called? Belle of the Bull Bronze or something? It's pretty cute. Yeah. This must be the beginning of Design Paris actually getting some good merch. Finally. What was that? I don't hate it. You don't hate it? Yeah, it's kind of chavvy. It is a bit chavvy. It's chavvy, but I like it. Yeah. Donald, I love like, Donald. It's kind of like, I feel like it could be like cool chavvy, you know? Cool chavvy. Yeah, like Disney chavvy. <laughs> it's going to be a new style, hashtag Disney chav. Hashtag Disney chav. Okay, the next shop is the confectionery stand. I've just noticed a lot of this new stuff. That's adorable. I'm like tempted to buy the candy floss and then use the tub for something. I don't know what, <laughs> but that's cute. These are the best. Oh my god, are you gonna get some? I'm definitely gonna get some this trip. I'm not gonna get some now because we're gonna go for dinner soon. But is that the flavour that you like? I absolutely love this flavour. And they have so many. Is it? Is it some kind of raspberry, bubble, bubble, isn't it? Raspberry oh, bubblegum. I like. Maybe it's raspberry. There's the lemon one and the strawberry one. They are so good. You can't get them anywhere else. In fact, maybe maybe one of them strawberry, one of them's raspberry, maybe. Yeah, then they have all these all these little lollies and different characters. There's like Mickey, Minnie, and Winnie the Pooh. Okay, and then they have this cute Paris themed range. Not sure what any of it is. There's some biscuits over Chocolate here. Biscuits sound nice. Well, we need to find those biscuits our friend brought back to work. They were really good. I like this tin, it's very Tokyo. It's very Tokyo, and that one's cute as well. It's not very it practical to use as a tin, but no. it's quite cute. Then they have all the Ratatouille themed stuff. And they have this apron, which is adorable. The packaging is just adorable. So many marshmallow things. I am obsessed with marshmallows. They're like the best thing ever. You do eat a lot of marshmallows. I love marshmallows. <laughs> so quite a few different types of marshmallows as well. Lots of big lollipops like you would see in the US parks. They're Becky only $3 is three no no. Becky's gonna get this one just to use tomorrow. as a prop. Yes, yeah, for a photo shoot. Adorbs. Adorbs. Like cuter than that. Right. So one of our friends from work. Um, her name is Rebecca Redican, but you can call her Becky. She bought these in for us because she came to Paris like last month. Yeah, and they, and are, they are so, so good. good. Like we've never had them before. We never buy any of the food here because Disneyland Paris food is not that good. Yeah, and to be honest, for me that looks like a dry cookie, but actually. It, but they're so good. I liked the chocolate ones better than the smarty one, but you like the smarty one. But they're both four ninety nine. That is not bad. And you quite a lot in that pack. So. And I guess you can get a double pack of them together. 
whether they are cheaper or not to buy Pretty together, fun. Becky will find out. Yeah, eight ninety nine for both. That's good. We might have to get some of them. And then I've just noticed behind Becky, there's some more tins. Oh, that's cute. I know. I really like these. Marshmallows. Oh, more cone. marshmallows. How much are they? Oh, Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. How much is this tin? Because I actually like it. Twelve ninety nine. Okay, That's maybe it's not too bad. Let's see. Oh, just little chocolate bars. Cute. That's adorable. Okay, that is so cute. I guess they've got like a little Valentine's range on the go at the minute. I didn't. Oh, don't touch the box. To see how much it is. <laughs> if I touch this one, I can like scooch it round. Okay, we're trusting Becky to not drop it. I think the price is probably on the bottom. Okay. Oh no, okay. no pressure. Oh no, there's no price on it. Oh, there's no price on it after all that. That means it's expensive. That's so cute. And they've got this like I love Paris range at the minute. It's very Valentine's Day. The mini is very, very, very cute. Ooh. Oh, it's got a what does it say on the back of it? On the back of the balloon. I just on Paris. Paris. And it. then they have phone cases, hoodies, they have these ears. Uh, not my oh, kind of thing. No, they, they, don't, <laughs> they look a bit flimsy. Look, look at that bag, that's awful. Yeah. And they're, like, they're 20 euros. 20 euros? I don't think so. That's and cute. a cute notebook. That's that. Oh, and then a little bit more of the Isle of Paris range. There's quite a lot of this. I've got that Becky has got that. And it's so cute. It is really cute. cute. I think they're about 30 euros as well for the t-shirts. Yeah. Which isn't too bad, I suppose. Oh, we need some gloves today. We do need some gloves today. It's very, very, very cold. But I'm not spending 26, 26 euros. euros. They're having a laugh. Ugh. Pretty sad. Okay, then there is this cute 2020 range. These are really cute. I mean, it's not my kind of thing, but Design Paris doesn't always have the best merch. So if you're into this kind of thing, and then they've got the t-shirt for kids. Boy and a girl one. Boy and a girl baby grow. If they're born in 2020, that's and then my friend Rebecca Reddington, but you can call her Becky, also bought me these ears when she came. Did you? Yeah, they light up. They're very cute. What did she buy you? I didn't even know she bought you anything. She bought me a t-shirt as well. Oh. Okay, and then like a little bit more Paris stuff. This is a bit like the spirit jersey from earlier, but it doesn't say anything on the back. And then this suitcase. This range has been around like forever. This range has been around for years and years and years. So I can't see it going anywhere if it's your kind of thing. Right, the last shop that we are going in on Main Street is the Emporium. This Emporium is not as good as Disneyland and <laughs> well, Disney World's Emporium, but it is not bad, but it's always extremely, extremely busy. Okay, it's currently frozen season. It is in Paris, so they have a lot of Frozen stuff out and about. They have both the new Anna and Elsa costumes. They have the Arendelle Aqua Is again. They have some mugs and stuff. This isn't, I don't think this is specific to Design Paris merch, apart from perhaps these statues have Design Paris um, stickers on them. I like the Christoph and Sven. And they are, oh, 30 euros, that's quite a lot. But, they are cute. Oh, these Mickey and Minnie's are cute. I don't think I've ever actually seen these before. They're really nice. Is it? Are they twenty nine ninety nine each? Oh no, they come as a pair. That's cute. Oh, that is really cute. Thirty five ninety. Thirty five ninety. And then more toys. This is the the shop that you'll find all the toys in. There's not really a lot in here that we are particularly interested in but for like kids and families and stuff this is where you get all your toys okay these are one of the nicest things that Disneyland Paris sell I think they have all the princesses and they also Disneyland Paris on them and they're not actually like they do look quite cute and I know they even have a Mulan one who's my fave and you've hardly ever seen Mulan merch they're only 15 that's really yeah they're only 15 oh there she is my fave and there's a Mushu one so yeah they're all really cute i know they used to do a mary poppins one i don't know if they still do but they are they're really good for 15 euros i think 
I have not seen purple potion or millennial pink ears for a long time. And this is the first place that I've seen these like classic mini ears again. Uh, how much are these ones? $16.99. So they're probably like the cheaper end of the scale of ears here. I wonder how much these ones are in comparison to like America. Yeah, so in America these are 30 aren't they? $30? $22.99. To be honest, I think these and Paris have put their prices of ears up because yeah, I think they used to be about 15 and then about 19. Okay, so they've got the bronze ears, which are 2299 as well. And then these ears are exclusive to Disneyland Paris. There's too many, she's gonna drop them. They're quite cute. I think they're a bit like the ones that they did on the 25th anniversary. Oh yeah, definitely. So that's probably the extent of the Disneyland Paris ear collection. 2299 for those. Okay, I totally forgot the Disneyland Paris do these like character ears. The similar ones are cute, but I always look at the Marie ones. They're cute. I think they're adorable, but they look. I think the ear looks too little for an adult. Like they're yeah. more for kids. They have Stitch, Simba, and Marie, and then there's the classic mini ones again. Here's some more cute statues. This time with Mickey and Minnie with the Eiffel Tower. Very on trend. I love this. Chippendale with the popcorn and also Scrooge McDuck. You don't see a lot of Scrooge McDuck these days. And then Mickey and Minnie with a balloon. That's super cute. Ah, with the Eiffel Tower. Are they taking a selfie? Has Mickey got the mouse got an iPhone? I think he does. That's wild. And then there's Remy with the Eiffel Tower. Okay, so they have these cute pens that also say Disneyland Paris. I actually got this one and this one for my best friend who's getting married later this year so they can sign their register with it and then there's some cute pencils and some more pens $11.99 oh yeah also Goofy's called Dingo here it's very strange <laughs> okay I know Disney World used to have a version of this t-shirt Disneyland Paris has it in red and also in white and then I believe this is a jumper version of it yep I'm always tempted to get the white t-shirt, but I just don't think I'd wear it enough. It's really cute and it is $26.99. And then finally, I think these are quite new because I've never I've seen never them before. Seen them. I actually like the style of Mickey and Minnie. I don't normally like when they mess with Mickey and Minnie. But I think that t-shirt's quite cute. Becky does not agree with me. I just don't mess with, with Mickey perfection. And Minnie. Yeah, they're perfect. And no. then this, I like this t-shirt. It is cute. Is that the back of a t-shirt? Uh, oh, no, that's, no the, that's the front. That's, that is actually quite nice. With the castle and the studio's uh, hat and statue. That's, that's pretty cute. And then they have kids versions of it as well. And little backpacks and photo albums. Okay, so that was our tour of the merch on Main Street USA. If you like this video, we also did a Tokyo Disney merch video last year, which is on our channel. And if you like this video, there'll be plenty more Design Paris um, videos coming in the next few weeks. We also have another trip next month. So maybe we'll update what merch is there next month. And we will see you next time.